Back to the Weather Watch right now and a live look at the Dan Ryan and predictably things not moving very well outbound inbound so far. It's good until you get to the Jane burn. Of course, it'll be mm. slow then. Yeah, but Steve is here with the check of the forecast, and boy, it was nice to feel that sunshine out there today. Yeah, I don't want the weather to move at all, right? <laughs> Let this stay around day after day. And I think we're going to keep this kind of weather for the rest of the week, everybody, until some changes come over the weekend. But we'll deal with that in just a second. What are these folks talking about today? Let's see what the weather watchers are talking about. Uh, they display temperatures in the 70s away from the lakefront and slightly cooler elsewhere. We'll go up north and we'll see what Kevin's talking about. He's got uh, 70 degrees in Lake Villa and he had a picture to go along with it. It's a beautiful uh, day today for strolling around and look at all that blue sky in between the trees. So uh, we're starting to feel a little bit more autumn like and you know something else about today's weather and uh, Hank knows all about the importance of those winds today. South winds, a pleasant breeze from the south will be blowing out at Wrigley. That usually means that's good home run weather if they're strong enough. Let's see what happens, but let's move on with the rest of the story. It stays breezy for the early part of the night. The winds will start to die down later on tonight, uh, but we'll keep the starry skies in the, the really nice conditions. Uh, temperatures officially 69 in O'Hare, 69 in Midway, 70 degrees at Gary. The winds are, are really telling the story. Everybody's got that southwest wind blowing from one end of the area to the other, sustained at 15 in the city, and they've been gusting up into the the 20s, especially near the lakefront from Waukegan all the way down through South Shore. Chicago's got the gustiest wind, so we know we're okay for the rest of the week. But what about this weekend story? I think the timing has the rain arriving, the bulk of it again, late in the day on Saturday. And unfortunately, more of Sunday looks like it could be rainy. Not uh, at this point, not talking about severe weather, but it looks like mainly showers. We will keep on top of that as we go along. The reason why we get these strong thunderstorms to stay so mild and almost spring like. Uh, but look at this map, man. We don't have anything approaching because that high is keeping everything far away from us as it takes care of this weather right in the middle of the country. So with that in mind, going out tonight, the later you're out, the chillier it gets eventually down to about 49 degrees. And for the next seven days, Really feeling good through the weekend. And look at 55 degrees next Tuesday. Get ready. That's pure autumn coming back. We're not even looking at that right now. We're no. just looking at all the <laughs> 70s coming up. Thank